Say, I'm so excited! <laughs> I said what I said. They're back. Or they never left. Food is so big, word, Lord. Have mercy. Make it pause like I do. 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 All those things in my jeans. We can get up in between. We're trying to get up close to me. I can teach you the power. What's up, K-Bangs? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Cairo. If you are new, Go ahead and hit that red subscribe button because we lit over here. And if you subscribe, you will be lit too. And if you're returning, you already right, know the vibe. So, y'all, what it do? It's time to get these armpits waxed. I could probably braid the hair how long it is. It's been a little minute. So, yeah. I am going to wax my armpits myself because y'all know I'm an esthetician. I could do this myself. Why not? Only thing I can't do is my Brazilian. But the armpits, eyebrows, all that, baby girl, we got that down pack. But I did get my wax kit. It is by Tress Wellness. I did get it from Amazon. If you do want to purchase this wax kit, you can get it from Amazon.com. One, two, three, four. Oops. Not as sticky for this. Five bags of wax beads that you can use from. So this is lavender, which what I have already poured in there. They have eucalyptus, peppermint, tea tree, and lemon. And they do give you some wax sticks. Also wax sticks for your eyebrows. You get some pre-wax spray and some after wax spray so you have everything that you need in the kit why not go ahead and purchase so you can be fresh and clean like me let's get it let's get it. always thank you to trust wellness for sponsoring today's video so yeah shout out to them here on 161 so i'm hoping that this is a good little temperature for us looks that way looks a bit stiff but i think it's pretty good our pre-wax spray. Dab it dry with a little paper towel. We don't own our pits. It's not it's not for the week. I'm telling you it's not. Ooh. Ooh. It wasn't that long, y'all. It won't be. We gonna do this one down so you could do a clean up strip. Oh, I just did that one up. I'm gonna do this way. Uh. Not on my bro, no. We have some technical difficulties. Oh, this gonna hurt. Mm. Oh. Oh. My hair is wetting them long. Why would it seem like when you're in the shower, it be seem like it's so much longer than what it is? Her. Oh, yeah. Nice and clean and fresh. Feeling great, feeling groovy. Purr, purr, purr. So. That was so messy. Ugh. Don't get in my way, baby. Oh. Ooh. It wasn't thick enough over here. Ugh. That wasn't a good strip. Maybe my hair is one now. He got it. I'm free. 
Thank you to Trust Wellness for sponsoring today's video, and let's jump right into it. It's the next Azay. Bow, bow, bow. Y'all, I've got a freaking package. When I say I'm so excited! Yeah, I'm so excited. Y'all, I guess seeing this, y'all wouldn't know. Y'all wouldn't know what it is. But I know exactly what it is. So y'all know, Blue, you won't even think about that water till I came right here with this camera. Blue! Chill, it ain't that good. Um, so y'all know on my last couple of vlogs, I have been saying I wanna invest and get another camera, and girl, did my research and I got me a new camera. When I say content finna go up, content finna go up. So, let me open it, let me open it, let me open it. I had got it from Best Buy, I ordered it online, cause y'all know I had went, I need a knife. I had went um, to Best Buy in my last vlog to look at them. Wasn't no point in the store and trying to figure out which one I wanted because they didn't even have one in the store to even look at. So that same night I came home, I got on BestBuy.com and I was doing my research and it was between um, this camera, the one I got, and the Sony, I think it's A7C. Well, now I'm like, I wish I would've got the Sony A7C because I just came across the video last night of the quality of that video, of the of that camera, and I'm sitting here like, damn, I should've got that one. But, y'all, I got the Sony EV10, period. When I say I'm super freaking excited, content's gonna go up. Like, let's just say this, content's gonna go up. So yes, y'all, I did get the Sony EV10, as y'all can see. I did get the um, the one with the kit lens on it. So I'm super freaking excited. I cannot wait. I'm actually gonna probably, I gotta go to make some errands, so I'm probably gonna vlog on it today. But y'all see, I just cracked it open. And yeah, I'm so excited, guys. I feel like this is gonna like just make me like literally like want to vlog. Like some days, like y'all get a lot of vlogs. Y'all get hour long vlogs. But some days, a lot that y'all miss, which is okay. Um, but it's some days when I don't even pick up the camera because it's like my hair not done, this ain't done whatever whatever and i'm just like ugh or i'm just clearly not even doing nothing like my life makes seem like it's lit but it's, it's really not but yes so this is i'm so excited oh my god oh my god it is so much heavier and bigger than my canon g7x y'all oh my god Look at her, girl. I don't even want to touch it. Oh my, God. oh my God. It's like, oh my God. I don't even want to touch it. 
So I'm assuming they already put the kit on there for you, which I want to know how you take. Oh, I can see how you take it off. I don't know how. We're going to have to see how to take that off. Just so I can invest in getting me a um, another one. So it comes with the camera, of course. Like I told you, I have got the, um, I think it's the 16... Girl, I got the kit lens that come with it, like that you got to pay for extra with. So I got that one. I don't even know how to explain y'all which one it is. It don't say nothing on here about it. I think it's the Sony girl. Whatever. We got the kit body lens. And I'm assuming, what is this? To charge it, you get a charger so you can, you can lie, cause you can actually charge the camera itself instead of just charging the battery. It does come with one battery, and I think I have to charge it myself, but I don't have. It doesn't come with like a charging base, like to put the battery in and charge. What is this? Instructions, manual, and all that good stuff. I gotta register it because, girl, I don't want nothing to happen to it. Reference grad, all that good stuff. So we got us a new camera. When I say content finna go up, baby, it's finna go up. It's actually a lot bigger than my Canon G7X. Like it feels very much bulky. Girl, I don't know. I'm kind of scared. But I did get the one that flip. <laughs> ah! And then I think I could go like, oh, that's how you close it. I gotta get um, a screen protector for it because this one, baby, has came in handy. So, I think I low key wanna charge the. I'm gonna go though, so let's see. Girl. Oh, there you go. I don't know how that looks. That looks very crazy, but. Got me into the camera! Oh, I don't have a memory card. That's one thing they didn't give. And I, let's pop her on. And she's not charged. So, let's charge her really, really quick. Now all I need is Final Cut Pro and I'll be one of the pros. Call me a, a YouTuber, baby. Period. We're gonna charge her for like 15, 20 minutes. I don't even know where this goes. Y'all, this is so crazy. We bossed up our YouTube channel by one step, getting a camera, a better camera. Not saying my Canon is that bad, but y'all know some things I want, like a wide angle lens, um, a wide angle lens, you can't put that on the Canon. Um, the autofocus, it's cool, but it don't, it ain't that good. Like say, if I wanted to like show y'all my nails like this, you see how it's blurry? I would have to like literally like, Get close like that and then show y'all, ugh, crusty ass cuticles. Come back and see, look. There we go. Um, and then, of course, I want to give like that soft, I heard that this has a a soft like filter to it. So that'll kind of like help me if I'm looking ugly, chopped like right now. So yeah. And then I just want to boss up my channel, so. We gonna see, and I'm hoping that I can. I'm hoping that I can use memory cards that I already have, cause I have a lot of memory cards. Oh my god, this is crazy! I have another camera. This is crazy. Oh, I'm like, why I can't see nothing? Oh, oh my gosh, y'all. This is crazy. Like, I, I'm so like, ugh. How do I take the, oh, I gotta get these nails cut down, baby. Cause. So. Sitting next to you guys. 
I definitely need a wide angle lens because that looks crazy. But I, I haven't even did nothing to it yet. Oh my God. We gonna just let her charge and I'm gonna put her down cause I feel like I'm gonna drop her and baby. Yeah. Let's let her charge and then we're gonna run our errands together on, on y'all because um, like I don't even wanna touch her. So we're off the target. I have to get um, some lotion, some detergent, um, some things that we need around the house. And then I was supposed to go to Best Buy with my camera so that I can find um, a lens that I want to get. I might just wait. And like just get my settings together with the camera. This is my literally my first time opening it, y'all. So yeah. Um, it's hot in here. Um, and then I have to what else? I want to go get my car washed. Which I have to get a, a hand car wash because I have a drop top. And the place I go to to get a hand car wash is closed today. And yeah. Because if I go through a regular car wash, I'm going to get wet right here in the creases. And I don't feel like having my leg wet today. I just don't feel like it. And I need to get the inside clean. Like, I need a real, like, detail, honestly. My car is so dirty and, cr and crunchy and just, ugh. I need to do that so I'll probably do that another day though because I don't know we'll see it be favorite stool I low key been wanting to try this and I think they be gonna try it gotta get my detergent it's the only detergent I use like two of these these are the they, got, they each stick gonna get these give me some lotion because my hands always ashy tops so that I seen in the last target they still eight dollars so I got give me some spring colors y'all and then I went over by the workout stuff and I seen this little jacket I had been eyeing. I want it. Why is it my size? And it's on clearance. $15. Really? Came to Target and got exactly what I needed and some. And I only spent $140, I mean $135. Well, actually, I only spent $129 because I had a coupon your girl's into coupon and now period so now we're gonna go to best buy so i can look for a memory card for my new camera i was just on tiktok and i've seen that you need like a one that records in 4k so yeah We'll see. I know you want to get these people a dollar, but I don't have nothing. I don't have no cash to get to. And they've been sitting right here for like a week or two. So I don't have nothing to get to them. I never have cash. Two wallets and not one has cash in it. Get them, glow. I'll come back tomorrow and get him a dollar or something. guys so i just tested out my camera 
like I hope I'm in like some good settings I don't really know so we'll see how this go um I actually kind of watched back and I think when I was like washing the dishes and stuff doing all that I was like in slow-mo so I need to figure that out I think I figured it out because I don't see it on the screen no more it was saying slow-mo on the on the on the viewfinder I'm like wait why is that saying that but um yeah so we're vlogging on our new camera today so I'm hoping the quality is like better and it's different yeah I can't figure out the autofocus though like how I just shut down my nails and stuff like that's the problem I was having oh there it goes so I just gotta move around a little bit I probably gotta, you know, get it a little bit more. But I did get my settings, like videos from um, TikTok. So I'm hoping that I kind of got everything looking good. I just gotta figure out. Um, do certain things, you know what I'm saying? So yeah. Hoping it looks good. I hope you yeah, like the quality. The image is different. I don't know. I have not sat down and edited off this off this footage yet so we're gonna see when I edit how it looks and if y'all have any tips of settings for the Sony EV10 please drop them in the comments below because baby I don't know what I'm doing I'm going off of what TikTok say what YouTube say and I'm hoping this shit look good I do know I'm gonna be finding me a um a wide angle lens because this is a kit lens that came with the camera well that I paid extra like a hundred dollars extra for to come with the camera and it will like before I press record it'll be like zoomed out like wide angle how I like it the minute I press record it zooms it back in so yeah I'm gonna have to get a new uh a new lens because maybe this ain't hidden this is not why I want well I want the camera to be able to change the lens don't get me wrong but then this lens is not I could have saved my little hundred dollars but I want to see if it was gonna you know be something but it's not giving me what I wanted to give um but I'm liking the vibe the camera is very very big and bulky bulky compared to my Canon G7X so it's something to get used to so yeah we're going with the huh, it's a little bit heavier i want to be more delicate with the camera i'm kind of like scared to use it not gonna lie but scared we're making it work to use what your camera the camera like it's like so big and like bulky i'm just like don't want to drop it i ain't got no script tech on it they making me hold on to this because y'all know my lens always dirty so this is the cover of my lens it's already yes, dirty videos, fingerprints and lint and shit all on the lens the new glass I just bought you? All oh, mine. Huh? Yeah. Well, you better shut up before I take them back. Do that then. Like, I don't have other pair to wear. I have plenty of He's smart. You a smart ass. I have plenty of I got another pair in my bag. Oh, good. Hmm. Anyway, so, yeah, yeah. I was just Man, look at this old woman booty. And her thighs. Like, what the fuck she got going on? Who the fuck did Who is it? I don't know. Oh. Um. She was sitting over there on the pump. She okay? Probably She not. with her? No. Oh. Uh. All right. We're going to move around from up here. Cause so now it is St. Patrick's Day. Me and Babe are helping his friend out right now. Um, but and then we're going to probably go to my mom's house and get her. This camera is so heavy. Oh, my God. Let me hold it like that. Go ahead. Oh, not me zooming in. Oh, double chin. What the fuck? Okay. Um, go get her and then we're probably gonna have some um probably gonna get some lunch or something. She wanna like hang out and do something. Today is St. Patrick's Day and also my cousin who passed away, it's his birthday. So she wanna get out the house and I don't blame her. It's a lot going on in her mind. So we're gonna do that and then um I don't really know. We're gonna take the day flow. We're gonna let the day flow how it flow. And then we probably gotta come back early. It's 3.19 right now. Babe has to work tonight. He is also with me. So, uh, we'll probably come back home kind of early or whatever. So, yeah. This camera heavy. AF. 
I'm hoping this looks good because I feel like I'm a new vlogger. Like, I feel like I ain't never vlogged before. Camera that I don't like. It's a lot of things on the camera I don't like. I ain't gonna lie. It makes a noise when you press the record button. That, y'all know I don't like with a lot of noises. Like, a lot of, like, little. I don't know. Like, I only like my phone, like, loud. My phone is always at the lowest volume it can be on, or it's always on vibrate. So, this little noise that it does when I press the record button, I need to figure out how to turn that off because it bothers me. Like, it really does. Like, why? Like, a little ass kid playing games or something. Girl. I can't figure out how to turn this off. So if y'all know how to turn that sound off, let me know because it's bothering me. It's bothering me. I wanna do something, let me see if this works. Is this gonna blur my background? Let me see. Defocus. Is it not focus? Let me see. No. I'm gonna turn it back on. Girl, I don't know. We'll see. I'm still playing with it, y'all. Still trying to figure this shit out. Cause baby girl, I don't read the manual. That maybe that's what you need to do. Read the manual. These hazards. Just, um. Maybe I should read the manual and uh, figure out some things about the camera. Ah, oh, I hate that. It be looking so far away that I press record and then it zooms it back in. Girl. But yes, y'all, what is up? It is the next day, as y'all can see. Yeah, what? Oh, they did drop my car last night. Um, we're headed to go get our car washed and cleaned out. I'm a vacuum to the inside myself, though. I got a whole bunch of household products. Got some paper towels, some Windex, and some awesome. We gonna make it work. Per per. And then y'all know I had got that um little brown like workout jogging top whatever and I didn't realize it had a security tag on it I gotta find it it has a security tag on it so I have to take this back to Target today so I can get that taken off I was gonna literally wear it today at the gym let's go put it on and baby you can't wear that you feel like you stole it can't wear that um but yeah y'all know I didn't steal it but um yeah had to go do my errands I was supposed to do yesterday, but didn't do it. Or something. I don't know about this wildlife shit, but we got some little friends in our attic. And it's really starting to piss me off. You know what I'm saying? Because a couple weeks ago, I was laying in my bed and I was editing, right? I just heard a little, so I saw a little rumbling. I'm like, what the fuck is that? But you know, I have dogs, so I'm thinking it's Oreo or Blue playing. So I kind of like ignored it. Mind you, I'm editing and I'm watching TV. So I hear it again, and then Blue starts to like bark, like like real, real loud. Like, what is that? So I'm like, okay. He, nah, I'm not just tweaking. He tweaking too. So let me put the let me put this computer down to the side. Let me just listen and see what's going on because it could be something going on outside. It could be I don't know. You know what I'm saying? So we sitting there, we sitting there, we listening, and we hear some like like a whole bunch of running back and forth and rumbling and all this extra shit, right? So I'm like, oh. y'all know, y'all probably don't know, but I'm very scared when it comes to spiders, blood, bugs, outside wild wildlife, cats. Possums, all that type of shit, girl. Instant scared. Like I don't, I don't fool with that type of stuff. So I'm like, oh hell no, they above my head. Oh no, 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 no. So I started recording on my phone. I should have recorded for y'all, but I was in my bed looking ugly. And girl, what is this car doing? They tweaking. Um, yeah, I ain't want to get on camera. I already look on camera, get on camera. Sometimes looking like, girl, what the. But anyway, so I started recording on my phone. Like if, if I can find the clips, I know I deleted it. So, well, I sent it to Bay and after Bay fixed it, I kind of like delete the videos. Whatever, whatever, whatever. So if I can find the videos in my phone again, I'm going to try to probably, like recover them back. Because, you know, if you would, whatever. I'm going to try to put some clips in so y'all can hear. Or whatever like that. So, um, I call him. I'm like, hey, uh, he's at work. Because y'all know he's working um, a different shift. So, he's at work. And I'm like, hey, um... We got some little friends in the attic, and I ain't liking it. He like, what you mean? I'm like, what do you mean what I mean? It's a little rumbling over my head right now, and um, yeah, I need to handle this. Well, I'm finna call pest control. 
He like, he like, like, like now, right now. I'm like, yes. I'm finna, I'm finna hang up. I'm to record some videos for you. I'm finna send it to you. He like, all right, cool. I sent him the videos. He called me like, what the? I'm like, yeah, yeah. It's going on right now. I'm at home. Like, what the hell? So he like, all right, babe, just chill, relax. It's okay. Like, bang on the ceiling or something. Maybe they'll stop. I said, okay, and I will. They gonna stop for a little bit. They gonna, he gonna go ahead because, if, if my, if, if, from my understanding. I've never seen a possum or some shit like wildlife, you know what I'm saying, during the daytime. They nocturnal to me. Because I hope this vacuum stuff still work up here while I'm over here driving. I think so. I just, I don't, think, I just don't think people come over here no more. Um, <laughs> I know you want to be seen, but damn. Um, so, he like, okay, but just chill. Not going to sit or whatever like that. Maybe they'll go back to sleep or they'll just chill out. Who is they? Cause I'm, I'm, it's only my understanding that it's probably like one or two. Who is they? Why are you saying they like it's multiples? I'm, I'm getting kind of scared. I don't know. Is this car wash even open anymore? They have to call. It's, it don't say that they call. Let's see. And you still trying to make an entrance. Save 20 per gallon. Okay, let's see. The works ultimate super save. Step one, wheel cleaner, express sealing, underbody flush, and heat it dry. Okay, we get $10. For ultimate save, you get a rainbow coat, three-step wheel cleaner, express sealing, underbody flush, and heat it dry. What's the difference? Okay, ceramic wax, ceramic sealant, tire gloss. I might as well pay the $18 to get all of that, right? Do I want to? I don't feel like, no, I'm not going to get away. I'm going to get the ultimate save. Her. Um, please, please take your trunk bed and remove your trailer hitch. We do the, we'll do the rest. Wait, I go through this thing, right? I don't know, they don't do it. Okay. Um, so, he like, okay, babe, well, um, I'll handle it tomorrow. Please when I get wait up. while we verify your membership. I don't have one. Welcome to our car wash. Please select an option from the list on the screen. Please select a car wash by pressing one of the service buttons the ultimate, on the screen. The ultimate, right, yeah, the ultimate. Please select an upgrade. Or, if you do not want an upgrade, I don't want one. If I would have got an upgrade. Please insert cash or card. Okay. I don't like you telling me what the fuck to do. Tap. You are now ready to enter the car wash. Please proceed by following the directions on the signs ahead. And thank you again for your car wash. You're welcome. Um, yeah, my legs gonna get wet, and I know. Yeah, I don't even. Oh, that's why you're here. Okay, cool. They just in here chilling. Do I just come up? They didn't even talk to me. Oh, it's a mirror here. Neutral. They don't do nothing. Oh. Hi. Okay. Okay, so he like, um, they don't worry about it. I'm going to handle it tomorrow when I get off work. I'm like, okay, cool, period. I ain't tripping. So I bang on the ceiling again because they start back doing it again. And. You don't know me! Oh my god. Um, let me get these paper towels ready because I know my legs gonna get wet. Um, <laughs> just why I should have went to a hand car wash, but I be, I don't like going to the hand car wash because the men in there be looking at me and I don't like that. So I'd rather just go do this and call it a day. But I know I'm gonna get wet. Let me Or whatever like that. Turn the TV back off. But seem like when the TV's on, y'all probably can't even hear me come. Huh? I probably shouldn't even tell the story right now because all these things. Alright, we're gonna come back and we get out of the car wash. When I was a kid, I used to be scared of this. I used to 
want it to be washed and clean. So I'm just gonna tell y'all the rest of the story while I'm um put a vacuum in my car. Well wait, it's vacuum in my car. Um, so I'm not gonna sit in one good more time and they like kinda like stop the rumbling. I'm like, okay, I'm turning the TV back on, turn the TV back on. I went back to sleep. It's finna rain. Y'all, I just think I'll just be doing shit. Didn't even check the weather today, but Oh no, it's supposed to rain Friday. Okay, cool. Um, so I turn the TV back on. I'm like, all right, blue, we're gonna go back to sleep. And we're gonna call it a one. We're gonna call it one. Go back to sleep, everything's fine and dandy. The next day, baby comes home. He's like, baby, I gotta go outside and see what's going on. I'm like, all right, cool. Mind you, he like, I'm gonna go in the attic first and see if they in there. Like, cause you know, you keep on hearing them do it at night. You don't hear them in the daytime. I'm like, what they do in the daytime? I'm not listening for them. I'm just, you know, I'm doing my, I'm around the house doing stuff. I'm not paying attention to the, what's going on. He's like, oh, okay. So he like, well, I'm gonna go through the attic first and see if they're still in there right now. I'm like, oh, okay. And my man, I don't want to see if they're in there or not. So I put a dip. So I went and went to the gym and did some stuff uh, that I had to do, run some errands, whatever like that. And when I came back, he's outside on top of the roof with his ladder, like doing some, girl doing whatever men do to do whatever he had to do. Somebody that you see him, he like, no, nah, I ain't see nothing up in there. He's like, but I'll see where they coming in at. So basically, these bad boys then like took our gutter or whatever the heck they did. They pulled it like, it must have been already like open, like probably from a storm or something like that, just like open. And they kind of like made a hole for themselves to get in. Like they basically like opened up our gutters or whatever, like they, whatever they did and like made their way to get in. So they was getting in through that way. And I don't know if it was day. I, I didn't see none. He didn't see none. Whatever the case may be, that was that day. So he still, he screwed it back on, like screwed everything back together, got some more screw, did what he got to do to close it up. Okay, fine. Couple days go by. I'm not listening, but I'm like chilling in my bed because I'm just watching TV, you know, watching Netflix, chilling, whatever like that. And nothing happened. So I'm like, okay, they gone. Like, cool. We, we could be, we could relax. We can go back to sleep and we can relax. No. Last night, they woke me up at 5 a.m. Baby, when I say I was instantly pissed off, like, bro, what? So, I'm, like, listening, and I, as I'm listening, the TV's off, the house is dark as shit, because, I, like, I sleep with the lights off. Well, it don't matter. I can sleep with my door open, door closed. TV has to be on, but sometimes if it goes off by itself, I'm cool. I don't, like, wake up and have to turn the TV back on, but for me to go to sleep, well, no, not really. I go see the TV on or on or off. It don't matter. Anyway, so by this time, it's about 8 o'clock in the morning. Nothing's on. No TV. Door, my door is open because I leave Blue running around the house at night for safety precautions. And he probably then ran back and forth going to get water, get food. I don't know. Whatever. So my door is like wide open. And I'm like, I hear the rumbling again. So I'm like, okay, what the fuck is that? Thinking in my head, like, I know Bay closed it. So what 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 you know what I'm saying what is that rumbling like they like running back like zooming like having the zoomies or whatever the case they're doing and I know this time it's like two or three maybe even four because I can hear like the our attic is like the, the whole side of our, our house so I can hear like like something going on over this way and it's something going on over that way like on the other side of the house like scratching or something so I'm like I'm like oh my god these mother are, are back they're back what is going on so now i'm hearing like maybe they're going at it or something i don't know like i hear growling and like rumbling and doing all the like fighting type of thing so i'm like oh hell no i'm like shut up go to bed like i'm yelling at them like they kids y'all like literally like yelling at them like they kids so they kind of like stop i'm like yeah so i lay back down here you go <laughs> Baby, when I caught that man so fast, I'm like, hey, they back. Either they wouldn't out the attic when you looked in the attic, or they didn't find a different way to get in this attic. Because they back. And I'm about to go crazy. He like, what? What you mean? What do you mean what I mean? I said what I said. They're back. Or they never left. He like, oh my God. Ooh, it gotta be a different place they getting in or they was never, they never left. Like when you looked in the attic, they might've been hiding real good. But they back. 
And it brought me back to I had and I low key like he was like, all right, baby, we gonna call pest control tomorrow or whatever like that. Well, I'm a I'm gonna figure it out because I don't know what the hell. Like I got on I got on the roof myself. I look I walked around. I looked. I don't see how they getting in. Figure it out, big dog. I don't know what to tell you, but I'm not kidding. I'm not doing it. I, I can't do it. He like I know, babe. I know. So he like all right. Well, go back to sleep. I turn the TV back on. You know, seem like when they hear noise in the house. They stopped the rumbling, but by this time I'm on my bed, like knocking, like cut it out, like chill, my. And this is five o'clock in the morning, y'all. So if they stop, or whatever, like that. I hear a little bit more rumbling in between, but it's not as bad to where it kept me up. So I turn my TV back on and I turn on Bad Boys, a movie that got a lot of rumbling going on, so they can feel like, oh, they up. Yeah, I'm up. You done woke me up. This battery dies really, really quick. I'm on 32%. Well, I've been vlogging, though. But I got four hours, 27 minutes on my memory card. So, I love that. Okay, anyway. um, Wasting my gas. So, I go to sleep. And now, I'm, like, trying to go back to sleep. And I'm, like, cool. I go to sleep. I had, like, a dream. Y'all know the episode on Martin? When they was out of town at, like, the little, um, like, wilderness resort type shit. And that thing was on his neck. And he... trying to get off his neck and stuff i'm gonna show i put the clip in that's the episode i kept thinking about like if, what, what if babe looked in that attic and they was like hi now and then when he was gonna get off the ladder or something they came at him and attacked him he was like girl i don't know why that was in my head but it was but that's my little story time y'all like i literally was up from 5 a.m to like 7. Babe came in, in the house from work it was like you still up yes i can't Stuff like that, I just can't sleep knowing that something above my head enjoying my attic. Like, what? And I don't go in the attic. Like, I ain't nothing in the attic for me. I don't, we don't have, I don't think we have anything in the attic like that. But just to know that something's up in my attic just living his best life. Baby, what are you doing here? Did you pack your bags? Because now you're gonna get evicted. We didn't ask you to be here. Why, why are you here? Like, why, of all houses, why you pick my house? My house, and then you enjoying it like it's a six flags or something. Go to bed. Like what the girl? Crazy. But anyways, y'all said you got my car wash. That's my little dilemma I had this morning because baby, guess what? It was one of the nights, and I'm about to go crazy last night because I, I don't got time. I don't have time for the goofy shit. I don't. I don't like that type stuff. Uh-uh. Cancel me out, baby. Cancel me out. Take take somebody. Take, get somebody else's house. Please. Go to my go to somebody else's house and figure it out. Cause not 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 my house. You're gonna be out of here. I have a bloom and a water. This is the super greens. Greens and super greens and mango to my water. It is the mango flavor. I got it from Target the other day, of course. Y'all see me grab it. So um my car is like I need like no, I need somebody like to do it inside, like for real. Like this, I, I'm not gonna be able to do this. My car is like filthy. Ooh. Like filthy, filthy. Like, she need like a little TLC. For real, for real. To the love and care. I wonder where I can go. Can you just go somewhere and get the inside clean? I need like somebody to give me these crevices like for real for real this is sad is that considered like a detail oh here got my all these things i was looking for this my little all these case to hold my little quarter in there girl okay yo who charger is this but baby we gonna keep it Oh, this for his son. This thing. Uh-uh. Oh my God! What the fuck was spilled up in here? One compartment I just did. I just did, and that's I almost filled the bag up. And then I just spilled it all in the front. Videos on TikTok and stuff. They be like, "Girls' cars." That should be for real. What is all this? 
Oh wow. I this gotta go in the house. This goes in the house. What's this? Oh clothes. Baby. Jumping cables. <laughs> I go to the gym. I found them. <laughs> These my glasses. They're broke. My mom could probably fix it. Sunflower seeds. I don't even eat those. I'm gonna take it somewhere to get it done because it's too cold out here, and I ain't trying to get sick. I rather a company do it. So let me see what I'm. These smell like they already been busted open and used or something. But I'm going to keep them just in case. The case is open so I, I would hate to put that on my ass and I break out or something. So we're going to throw that away. Whoo girl! You found a lot when you clean your car out. Put my little hand sanitizer up in here. What else? These glasses gotta go to the house. You know, I'm gonna fix them funny. This gotta go in the house. This lotion I'm gonna think I'm gonna keep. Well, I don't even like this smell. It's probably why it's back to. And this is my little care case, y'all. They got everything I need like lotion, hand sanitizer, stuff like that. I guess I'll be living in my car. You would think, huh? Yeah, I'm gonna go somewhere to get this bad boy detailed because that's all I gotta go in the house. And I was looking for these little crops. And record while I'm charging. Nah, I just play. All right, y'all, so that little cord I found up in here, yeah, it's gonna stay up in here because y'all know my battery, I was gonna die. But I did buy like two or three batteries. Um, they're coming Thursday, I got them off Amazon. So hopefully it's the right batteries. And I bought a battery pack to charge the batteries on, you know, at night or something. So yeah, um, but I decided, I did vacuum the car out a little bit. So when I pull up, I don't look too nasty. Yeah, uh, so I vacuumed it a little bit, but the section on the vacuums that I was just at, baby, I might just scrape it up with my hand because it wasn't even sucking up nothing really that good. It looks okay, but I need somebody who's gonna really, you know, get that lotion off their elbows and really crease this shit up. So we're gonna go to this uh, car wash that I be going past every day and see if they can do the inside for me because I know I just got the outside wash and it look. She look good, baby. I should have got the tire shine, but it's okay. It's still winter time up here, so you never know. We might be supposed to rain Saturday, so we we gonna just leave it where it's at. Leave it where it's at, okay? This bloom is really really good. If y'all um into good health for yourself, invest in some bloom. They bloom a day, keep the blood away. So we gonna uh, bloom a day, keep the blood away. We gonna be keep the blood away, keep the blood. Away. But anyways, um, this mango is really really good. I have the berry flavor at home, and I'm just like, ugh. This mango hitting y'all see how much yeah and y'all know i'm back in my um workout era just we're gonna have a real transparent moment like a real transparent moment like i was putting on some jeans the other day and i'm just like these jeans fit really really good a couple years ago and for me to have to suck in my stomach and put these bitches on it really shows a lot. So I'm like, I got depressed. And let's just say this, I love who I am. I love who I am as a person, as a woman, you know, who I'm becoming. But I do have my flaws that I don't like about myself. Don't get me wrong, I'm sure a lot of people do. Uh, and what, what, one thing I really, really face a lot with myself behind closed doors, off camera, you know what I'm saying, to myself is my weight gain. Um, and that's something I really, really deal with very, very hard because I don't like it. But I feel as though if I don't do nothing about it, how do I think things are going to change, you know? So, oh, this is not working for me right now. What's going on? Um, so, 
going back to the gym and getting back in the gym, it really, it's a lot. It's a challenge for me because I'm lazy as AF. But if I'm not happy within my skin, I'm happy within my clothes, I need to find a way to become happy, you know? And um, this brings me back to a couple weeks ago, me and Babe had did our staycation, and this girl, she had reached out to me on, um, I think it was Instagram. Let me see. Let me go to it. Shout out to Bria. I think it's Tequila. Te tequila. The picture of me and Babe for his birthday, whatever like that. And she's like, happy birthday. Enjoy. I'm like, thank you. And she hearted it. And she's like, you better be vlogging too. And I instantly was like, I'm like, oh my God. She followed me on YouTube. I'm like, you follow me on YouTube? She's like, yes, I do. Um, I love your vlogs. Your Galentine's one you hosted recently looked lit as fuck. I out, um, lit as fuck. And she sent another text. And I'm like, oh my God, thank you for the support. And she sent another text um, and said, always, you're a, vibe, you're a vibe and you're lit and you're down to earth and you're beautiful and black and with a real body, not a BBL like everybody, everybody damn else. Not too many folks on social media like that anymore. I respect that for you. I said, oh, oh my God, you just touched me. Thank you so much. That was so sweet of you. And you're right about that. True. And she's like, yeah enjoy your day i'm like you too and that was like kind of like it but later on that day i was like just analyzed i'm just like wow like somebody who like don't know me and like gives me props about you know kudos to you know your your lifestyle and your and your body and stuff like that and that's one thing that i you know i, I fight against it with myself like i cry i'm depressed you know different things like that when i put on different outfits it'd be like like, uh, I'm not wearing this. I don't like it with this look. My stomach's too big. My back rolls. Like, it's just so much that I go through. And I'm just like, for somebody who don't know me to, you know, reach out and say those things about me, it really, really made me feel like, very like, wow, okay. Really touched me, you know, because she don't know what I go through behind closed doors when I put on my clothes and put on different things. Or like, when I'm naked and take pictures and stuff like that, how I feel, you know? And, you know, it was just like that. And then the other day, I had went to the gym and I was doing my sit-ups, whatever like that. And respectfully, I had, um, respectfully to baby, whatever like that. Because he, he know the situation. So, um, I could tell the story. You know what I'm saying? So, I was doing my sit-ups and whatever like that. And I had my headphones in. So, I'm not, when I'm in my zone, oh my God, camera, stay. Um, when I'm in my zone, I'm not paying attention to what's going on around me like I'm, I'm watching but I'm not watching because I'm trying to work out you know what I'm saying and this guy he ended up coming like not by me but close by me he had kind of like looked and then I didn't think enough I just looked at him and put like like some of my music I'm just like what the fuck like why are you come over here in my area like all this big old space and you want to come over here in my area and I'm like, I'm like I just kind of like look like what the fuck like you know he's, he's like oh my bad my bad I'm like oh okay so I got back to doing what I was doing and he went back to his little corner and he worked out and whatever like that so I'm like okay cool he ain't on no goof on no crazy shit what the fuck so I'm doing I'm still doing my setups but I'm sitting you know I'm in between um sets so I'm sitting down on my phone I'm scrolling I'm actually looking for my next workout because I've been on TikTok looking up cardio you know workouts for beginners or whatever like that so I'm sitting there, I'm doing, going through, like I'm sitting there like my little 15 minute, 10 minute, whatever rest. And he come back over there again. I'm like, you need something? He like, no, nah, I'm just admiring your beauty. And I'm just like, huh? And he was like, I'm just admiring your beauty. I'm like, me? Cause mind you, he got on headphones. So I, don't know, I don't know if he on the phone or he's singing a song or whatever is going on. So I'm like, I'm like, me? He like, yeah, you don't want over here. I'm like, oh shit. I'm like, thank you. That was so sweet of you. Thank you. And he was like, he could appreciate the talk. And he was like, um, so what's your name? I'm like, like, I'm like, Kyra. And he like, oh, okay, you come here a lot. I'm like, mm, I just start back. He's like, he's like, oh, okay, that's cool. You know, you never, um, don't knock, don't never, um, what he say, you starting your blessings. You know, what, no, what he say, he's like, it's okay to be starting your workout routine. You know, it's okay. You know, at least you started. You ain't just sitting somewhere. You're not starting. I threw my head like, nigga, two days ago I was, but okay. Uh, I'm like, yeah, thank you. And he was like, yeah, he's like, just keep on going, keep on going. Basically, giving me encouragement. I'm like, thank you. And I'm not feeding into him because I'm just like, you came over here weirdly the first time. Now you over here talking to me like, what's going on? And um, he like, um, he like, well, can I get your number? I want to um, get to know you some more. I'm just like, 
I'm like, uh, I have a boyfriend. He's like, oh, okay, my bad. I'm sorry. You know what I'm saying? Carry on. I'm like, yeah, you welcome. I'm like, it's okay, cool. Like, carry on. And it was so awkward because, and I may, this may come off weird. This may come off like, girl, what? But another thing that I like cosplay in my head a lot, this camera is really moving around. Maybe I got this charge on here. Um, I play a lot is because a lot of times like when I'm out with my friends or I'm just out in general um, and then you hear on social media and different things like the like videos and my podcast stuff like that you I'm around a lot of men that you know talk they're very vocal you know and you hear a lot that a lot of men don't look at women like me who are out of shape who are you know bbw and who are necessarily i'm just gonna say it, ain't got their body done you know what i'm saying they go for the girls who got their body done who done up who titties sitting up to north carolina booty sitting all the way to texas like you know what i'm saying who got their figure right or even not people who got their body done girls who are more fit you know what i'm saying so for him to say that to me and I'm in a state where I'm very like working out and I don't like my body and like try to talk, talk to me, it kind of like made me feel like, well damn, okay people do like what people like me, you know what I'm saying? Or women like me. So it was just like a mm. and I honestly feel like a lot of men in a sense, look past people who are not you know what should I say like who are not like me like I feel like I'm just gonna say I feel like I look I get looked past like um nah she she too big or you know what I'm saying she this or she that or no nah, mm -mm, her stomach too big or you know something like that so I feel like him doing that made me, made me like it like it like ring a bell in my head like girl it's okay and one day you're gonna get to that point where you're gonna be happy in your own skin you're gonna be getting looked at not that i want to get looked at or that i want to get talked to but you do feel some type of way when you always the one or you feel like you're always the one who's not getting no no play don't get me wrong i get i get play respectfully i do have a man so that okay i'm the interior cleaning i do get play but you know i did not deny a lot of men because i have a man i, I love that I do because the dating scene nowadays it's literally not shit but um order police or do not wait on hostage uh, um you know you I don't know if I'm supposed to go here or interior cleaning do I pay here though okay um you know I feel like a lot of men look past BBWs or they look past um a lot of women that are not their style but they go for women that are cooked by the figure you know which is fine tease your own it's somebody out there for everybody don't get me wrong but for these two people within my life the last couple weeks or like that to like really express that to me was like really like a okay an eye opening you know and i don't want y'all to take this no no a different way or the wrong way or to think that i'm just like damn girl you just really not happy with yourself all around which i am but like i said i have flaws that i deal with behind closed doors that i don't like about myself and that's okay i feel as though i could be honest and express how i really really feel and to know that i'm doing something about it my, like now you know what i'm saying and don't get me wrong it's been times where i'm like i'm gonna get my body done i'm gonna do this i'm gonna do that and it's just like i'm very very scared of stuff like that even when i had my surgery for my thyroid problem on my throat baby i was panicking like high blood pressure was high as it was like 200 over 108 like literally i was panicking y'all like literally like going through it so um just to know that i will sit there and go get my body done i don't think i can go through it when it comes to that and then i also think about like me and babe are currently trying to have a child so going to get my body done and backtracking and go get a, to get a baby i'm going to gain that weight back i don't want to do that you know what i'm saying so i'm kind of like uh, uh, we're not gonna do that but honestly i did think about getting um 
the gastric bypass or whatever when they make your stomach smaller and you lose weight like that that's one thing that's on my back brain like yeah i'm have to, one day i'm have to, i'm gonna have to talk to the doctor about that because that's something that i really really feel like i need to do i feel like it would help me in a way but i'm trying to do it natural first hold on here she come hello good um this is my first time well not my first time but i never had the inside done so how does it go so because it needs to be like you want it there okay so for like the regular detail which is like the 36 99 you're paying for the one time it's so it focuses on your window She's all nice and clean. I see some spots that I gotta, you know, touch up, but for the most part, she nice and clean. Yeah, 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 yeah. 70% confident, cause I know I'm pretty. I know I'm this, you know what I'm saying? But of course, I deal with, girl, I deal with some things that I don't like about myself. And that's all I was just trying to say, you know? Don't take this the wrong way, guys. Please. Oh, it's gonna be fire. Should I put all of these? Yeah, we're gonna put all of them since they already like seem like they like busted open from being in here so long. Wait, hey, guys, I was just expressing myself and letting y'all know some things that I go through. I don't know if y'all go through it, or you may know somebody who's going through it. And you know, they might need like a little pep talk, but girl, somebody is looking at you. Don't get me wrong. They looking. They may not say nothing, but they looking. We didn't pull up to Target, guys, so I can have them take the security thing off. I'm throw this away. Have them take the security thing off for me. It's more sometimes in my glove department, baby. And if y'all have not realized, I love black ice. If my car wants to like black ice, I don't want it. And I ain't gonna lie, I don't do the thing where I keep the plastic on there. I take it all the way out. Girl, I'm not finna. I don't know if I should last longer, but baby, we don't care about that. I'll just go buy another one. Work, Lord, have mercy. Work. Work.